Hello, greetings, my friends. This is Gilles. I thought I'd come and say hello, wish you a good day. We, we, we live in, a, in captivity right now, and, um, and so, so it, it is a trialing time, but we're never, we were wondering when this crisis will be over. Nobody really knows, for the, there is all kinds of, uh, of, of possibility that well, it might linger or it might be shorter, but we'll see. But there, is, there will never be a return to the old ways, for we're going to learn so much through that process that we're going to be able to turn, turn upside down all the system. Everything that's dysfunctional will be turned upside down and we're, we're going to be able to, to, to make 5G um, antennas um, armless we're gonna we're gonna dismiss all those vaccination and all those process those those darker things that have been going on for Pluto in the at the end of the solar system we have this planet very important planet it's called Pluto so it's not a planet but it's got it's got many moons as such as Kerberos, Hydra, Nyx, Styx, uh, Charon so it, it is a real world and, and it is the hidden it is what is hidden it is what is uh, the underworld and so all those things that are hidden when Jupiter is coming today to to meet it will come all the all the corruption all that is dark will be eliminated will be put into the will be seen and so, and so as we see it we're going to be able to, to to transform it for there is two paradigms that are that are meeting each other is the, the diamond light paradigm, uh, the, the the paradise paradigm, and then the dark box of the dark uh, of the dark masters for for the the, the survival mode. For now they are in survival mode. Huh? It is positive against negative reality, the service to self and, and, and the service to, to, uh, to, to humanity. I'm sorry. I'm not really sure what's going on. It's advertising that just keeps on going. Like, they, they, they'll never stop. <laughs> We're gonna have to. And uh, <clears throat> anyway, there is. The, we want to integrate the Sophia, the, the divine feminine, and the and the Christos, the divine masculine. So it is the paradise. The the paradise timeline against the, the black box huh, for, for long, the longest time um, throughout the Kali Yuga, the, the dark magician has been uh, entrapping humanity in this illusion of fear. Uh, but now it is over. They have to use so much energy to maintain the little power they still have. When white magic, the, the power of love and blessings, uh, is, is so much easier, so much more powerful. So envision uh, the earth. Uh, within the sphere of white light and you send it to the core and you bring it back to the atmosphere and then you, you send this white light through all of the human population to destroy this coronavirus. Corona means crown. And so... Uh, for the, there is a, the, the artificial timeline is, is the one of the dark, but the natural timeline is, is the one of the of, of the ascension. So so it is about um, there will be uh, there will be the, the light workers, all those who work in the light, not just the light workers, but all those who are working for the freedom of humanity against those who are trying to entrap them. And there is humanity in between. So we're working towards a new polarization. It will be no more duality, but we're going to need to re uh, reassemble our systems. It is a battle of the psyche eh, that's been going on for a very long time. Um, and so um, it's a step-by-step -step process of ascension that we... That we um, and, and during Easter, there may be some cosmic event that will shift all things. If there is those three days of darkness, you wake up in the morning, there is no light, close your doors and don't, don't go walk the dog. <laughs> Let it pass. It's like in the Ten Commandments. If that would happen, there is very little possibility, but it could happen. Spirit could utilize this time to, to shift the world like that, like liberating all the darkness into the, the, the earth's surface in order to, to expurge it. It's like in the, in the Ten Commandments, this old movie. It's like when death passes, just close your door and let it pass. It will only last three days. Hopefully, we'll still have electricity. Otherwise, it will... Will be a great test uh, for humanity. We may have still screen, or for um, what we're going to do is we'll go through the zero point in order to achieve that. Huh? It's it's um, and create this bubble around you, this bubble of light, of white light around you. It's it's, it's uh, for, and ask the, your I am presence to elevate you, to anchor you above all those, those chaotic uh, situation. And uh, so we, we are called to return home, to return to the heart. For we're going to be able to rebalance the system. It will be those in neutrality. Humanity will be doing that once the the dark and the light will have uh, completed their uh, their mission, so to speak. And so um, there is a, a need for neutrality. For we have reached critical mass. The Arcturians were saying we have reached critical mass for contact for this this virus was a. 
was actually created to kill billions of people, but, but the, the galactic were authorized to diminish its potency to the maximum. So, so I'm not saying it is not, um, it is not a difficult situation today. We want to keep on sending love and light and strength to all the people that are in the front line, that are all, all the, the medical professionals, but also the, all the, the people that make society function during this, this time and to send, uh, say that we, we are there to support them on the energetic level. And uh, we have reached critical mass for contact. So, so, so know that things can happen a lot quicker than what we can believe. Or, uh, um, and so, um, but understanding we'll never come back to the normal world. Huh? We're going to create a better world. All is going about, is about to change. And we want to thank all huh, for, for, for participating. Um, and so uh, for the darkness will be exposed and then transformed uh, everything will be transformed it's a great opportunity next year we'll, we'll definitely for we, we still have uh, some challenges before us but we're, we're going to be moving into a new level of, of, of freedom and, and it is necessary there was no way. if something happens in the universe it's often because there is no choice for the highest wisdom is the Amerindians the Amerindians are the people that care about the, they used to the fact they used to the there was people that that really honor and love and respect nature they love and honor animals and plants and uh, now we, we've lost that we, we've become very disconnected in this Darwinian system of like domination of the world the, the survival of the fittest because we were on top of the, the chains that gives us the right to abuse ever to, to, to abuse all of those who are inferior it's like if somebody's stronger it's, it's justified because somebody is strong to abuse to, to to abuse those who are weaker so so it's like uh, it's it's no longer valuable we, we all won and so we want to be supporting each other there's going to be a lot of of new understanding in terms of solidarity right now there is still a, a politicization of the for this of what is going on but but we're going to come out of that and, and nations will will there's going to be a lot of change and a lot of um, transformation what we need to understand is the healer how to bring things into healing into wholeness into completion what we need to do is love life or i'm, I'm really eager to be able to come out of confinement <laughs> it's like i'm preparing myself there's a great relationship that is coming for it is a it is a, so, so just a, it, it is good to, to be able to cultivate even that romantic love to be receptive for for when you, we attract those who are who are complement to us huh? and so to just work on yourself the more when the more we are able to purify our heart the more we'll meet somebody with a pure heart for intention is very essential we're going to purify our physical body but purify our heart is very very essential to have good intention and to clear up from the mental process all the negative judgments so that we can be free if somebody needs to judge, judge God knows, and, and um, even in the Bible, this is, uh, I am the Lord, the judgment is mine. <laughs> it's, not, it's not for humanity. Humanity has just not have enough lucidity to take on the, the right um, judgment. Well, it doesn't mean that <clears throat> we don't, we still still need the human justice, of course, but, uh, um, but, but to, to disengage from, from those, this locking mechanism, us against them, for we are all one. And the outcome is the self, it's the magic, it's the, to becoming white magician, to become benevolent creators in, instead of of feeling that life is, is oppressing us we become the creator we all are a unique creator we have unique timeline unique energies and so <clears throat> so let us uh, let us continue on this this path let us continue to to cultivate our light and love and and to uh, and, uh, and awareness lucidity um for inwards, the, we, we want to go inwards, and sometimes inwards there is darkness inside. But this darkness that we go inside, when if you have the courage to go in, into your own darkness, you, the light will emerge from that. Huh? It, is in, it is, we got to understand that light and darkness are essentially complementary, but they don't have to oppose themselves. And uh, we're getting ready to move through the zero point. There's going to be through this Easter, maybe very, very significant on that level. <coughs> um, for we want to respect and forgive the opponent, the darker ones. Uh, just uh, we just want to bring into justice and balance, and we we do, we do not have this vengeance or this desire to see them punished or whatever. They were here to show us the. To, to, to be the catalyst for our own enlightenment, for our own empowerment. So they, they, it was a very um, risky role for, for, for souls to come down and play the role of the bad guy at this, at this time. So, so, so 
And even they could, they, they could turn, in, they can realight, uh, bring the light back within themselves and join the, the family of light. They will bow down to the light and let go, and then we'll be able to, to reintegrate them. For it's, it's kind of a complex plan, but, uh, and God only knows, but uh, I just thought I'd share some thoughts and ideas. Here it is a portrait of, <coughs> of a woman. It was created on 13 of April 2019, so it's almost one year old. And this is a, a self-portrait with astrology. It is uh, my astrology. It is, uh, it is the, the fourth one, the fourth painting I do, I do on that subject. It's quite nice. It's got a striking look, striking eyes. You can make eye contact with the painting. And, and the eye just follows you wherever you go. I'm going to sing this song. It felt very appropriate. It's a, it's a small song. <coughs> it goes like this. Don't worry. About a thing, cause every little thing is gonna be alright. I say, don't worry about a thing, cause every little thing is gonna be alright. Rise up this morning, smile at the rising sun. Three little birds pitch by my doorstep. Singing sweet songs of melody pure and true, saying, This is my message to you. Don't worry about a thing, cause every little thing is gonna be alright. Singing, Don't worry about a thing, cause every little thing gonna be all right rise up this morning smile with the rising sun three little birds pitch by my doorstep singing sweet songs of melody pure and true saying this is my message to you don't worry about a thing Cause every little thing is gonna be alright Singing don't worry about a thing Cause every little thing is gonna be alright So we ask to, to be patient and to stay confined, to be patient. For, for right now we are deprived of our freedom, of our liberty, for, but pe many people die to obtain those freedoms. So, so we are not going to be wanting to go back to the old cycle where we're controlled and we're, we're under, under frequency control. And when we're going to come out, we don't know when we'll come out of this crisis. I was talking about July, I hope so, but maybe before, before, maybe later. But, but, but in essence, uh, people are going to want, uh, they're going to want uh, the a new system when they're going to come out of that and we'll never return to the old and we're going to be able to prepare the, the to prepare all the systems of our for functioning so society and functioning to 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 prepare the the the, the the ascension that will come afterwards for humanity, but already we are we are already on the threshold the 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 card of the day is may the truth be. It's about uh, bringing the, this, this, this higher truth, so wanting to be as, as clear, as honest, as sincere as possible. To be, we want this truth to be known, uh, and all will be known. For Jupiter will definitely uh, um, put a light on all the corruption and all the darkness. So we'll see it and we'll be able to transmute it, but be, be compassionate in bringing this justice into the world. So do, not be, um, do not go into... Um, into uh, where you want to respect, it's like in martial arts, you respect your, your opponent, huh? you, there is, so you respect and forgive, and, but yet we, we want to find this new polarization of a system that will be uh, far more integrated and more inclusive of all, all beings, and including nature, including animal, the animal kingdom, including the, the water, the the water, the, the plants, uh, um, all, all the, the elemental kingdoms, all we're going to become far more conscious and we're going to be able to, to really start a new, um, a new cycle uh, that will be uh, coming out after this phase. So I, I, I hope you, you, you're patient and, and you, you, you continue to cultivate and this, this, uh, this energy of, 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 uh, of connection to your soul and spirit. I wish you a wonderful day. I'll talk to you later. Thank you. Namaste.